I married a stranger because my mom is in the hospital and I have no way to pay her medical bills and I am drowning in debt trying to pay them off. I'm sorry I'm late. You must be the bride. I'm your groom, Sebastian Klein. This is our home now? Look, I know that both of us don't want to be in this situation, so I figure we'd both just be the happy couple in public and just stay out of each other's affairs. And when the trust fund is released, then we can get a divorce. How's that sound? Deal. Deal. <laughs> Until we get divorced, I'll be a good wife. And I'll respect our marriage. You can take the room. I'll take the couch. The satin on these shoes are scratched. Designer, you have to pay a restoration fee. Don't get married if you have no money. Ah, that pair is too ugly for my wife. Sweetheart, why don't you try that pair? It's $7,000. We'll take it. Oh my gosh. Sit down, please. Are you just going to stand there? Help my wife put on the shoe. If this is going to be a problem, then I need to talk to your manager. It looks lovely. Cheers. Hey, sir, how much can I get for these? Uh, never one than one. Fine. I'll give you 3K. You look like you can use the cash, so I'm gonna help you out. Actually, they mean a lot to me. I don't want to sell them. Excuse me now? Don't be greedy. 3K is a lot of money. You better sell now what you have chance. It's not about the money. I'm sorry. So you're just here to waste my time? What you holding? Hurry up. Hand it over. You take that and go. I'm on my phone with her. Help! Somebody help me! Hey! Get your hands off my wife! Oh. Which hand did you use to touch my wife? What? I said, which hand did you use to touch my wife? Please, I'm sorry. I'll tell you everything. Nick Volkov, he's in the Russian mob. He told us to do this because she wouldn't agree to sell. Mm. The Russian mob, huh? Well, you tell Nick Volkov that Sebastian Klein is coming. I'm sorry. Why are you so sorry? I shouldn't have tried to pawn off your gift. I changed my mind. I couldn't go through with it. That's what you're sorry about? Yeah, is, isn't that why you're mad? No. No, I'm mad because if you had money problems, you should have come to me. I'm your husband. Why didn't you ask me for help? You could have gotten hurt today. And what if I wasn't there? What was going through your head, Natalie? My husband? Yes. You were the one that said that this is all pretend and that we should just get divorced. What choice do I have? I got rejected from BM because the interviewer hates my guts. I married a stranger because my mom is in the hospital and I have no way to pay her medical bills and I am drowning in debt trying to pay them off. 
I don't know what to do, Sebastian. I'm trying my best.